We got another reaction quest. We're about to react to it. It's SML movie. Bowser Jr. learns Spanish. Wow. So Bowser Jr. is finally learning a different language, man. And I remember the days where, man, back in the day when I had Spanish class one and two. Man, I ain't gonna lie. I was struggling in those guys. I was struggling in those guys, you know. I was struggling in those guys. But hey, hey, you know what? You boy, you boy doing that work. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, let me talk and let's go ahead and jump into the video. I have no idea what will happen. Make sure you smash the like button. Make sure you subscribe to it. Both of them are going to be crazy. And without further ado, let's bomb it all, man. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Do it. Also, I was not the best. Today, we're going to be learning how to speak Mexican. You're going to need to know how to speak Mexican because one day, you're going to find yourself at a Mexican restaurant and the waiter's going to bring you your food and say, hot plate. But you're going to touch the plate anyway and put your hand because you didn't understand what they said because they were speaking Mexican. So we're gonna learn how to speak Mexican. Any questions, class? Um, it's not called speaking Mexican, it's called speaking Spanish. Spanish, Mexican, same thing, Cody. What do they speak in Mexico? Mexican. See, it's that simple. Okay, but well, what do they speak in Spain? Mexican. What about Puerto Rico or Cuba? They all speak Mexican, Cody, but we'll call it Spanish for you. You wrote Spanish on the board. All right, class, don't no pay attention to Cody. He dumb, he not know Mexican. Anyway, class, does anyone know how to say hello in Spanish? What about you, smartass? The Spanish word for hello is hola. No, that's how you say hello in Hawaiian. I asked how you say hello in Mexican. I mean, Spanish. Yes. Alright, so the way you say hero in Spanish is El Hero O. El Hero O, Crass. El Hero O. What? Guys, not even how you say hello in Spanish. Very good, Crass. Now that you all know how to say hero in Spanish, we're going to learn how to say bye in Spanish. The way you say bye in Spanish is Adios. El Bayo. So, El Hero O, Crass. And when we read, we say El Bayo. What? Are you kidding me? You can't just add L and O to the beginning and end of every word and say it's Spanish now. All right, Crass. Now that you know how to say bye in Spanish, you're probably wondering how do you say this bye in Spanish. Well, it's very similar to this bye, except this one is El Bayo. So, the difference between El Bayo and El Bayo is this bye, you're going to say it while you're waving. So, El Bayo and this bye, you're going to say it with money in your hand, like you're going to buy something. El Bayo. What? What if you don't have any arms? That doesn't even make sense. Well, you better have arms if you go into Mexico, Cody, or else no one's going to understand you. All of this, pointless if you don't have arms. Arms is very important to the Mexican language. So, this buy and this buy, no one's going to understand you if you don't have arms. Because they're going to think you're trying to buy something and leave at the same time. Anyway, class. So, now that you know how to say buy as in El Bayo and buy as in you're going to buy something, now you're probably wondering how do you say this buy. This buy is like this book was written by. The way you say this buy in Mexican is... Let me guess. Is it El Bayo? Oh, no, very close, Cody. Very close. But they different. The way you say buy in Spanish is... El Bayo. That's what I just said. <laughs> well, what you do with your hands is very important, Cody. Because the way you say this buy is El Bayo. And the way you say this buy is... El Bayo. You have to have money in your hand, Cody. Right. And in the way you say this buy, El Bayo, you must have book in your hand. See, book is written El Bayo, Dr. Seuss. Understand? No. Why don't we just learn regular Spanish? This is very complicated. I know, I know. Mexican can be very confusing. So let me use all three buys in a sentence to help you understand. So what you're going to do is, you're going to walk into the library and say, El Hero, Mrs. Librarian, I would like to El Bayo a book. That was written El Bayo, Dr. Seuss. She's gonna take your money and now you own book. 
But before you leave, you're going to set the book down and say, El Bayo, you cannot say El Bayo while holding book in your hand. Or else you look like this. El Bayo, El Bayo, like, who wrote this fucking book? You know who wrote the fucking book. It says Dr. Zeus on the side of the book. So you have to put the book down and say El Bayo. Then you can pick the book back up and leave. Any questions, class? Yeah, what? I'm dropping out of this school. All right, class. We're running out of time. So we're going to go through these last three very quickly. Yes. All right, the next word we have no. is name. No, How you say name in Mexican is... Nemo. Bingo was his name. Very famous Spanish oh song. Behind NGO. And Bingo was his name. The next word we have is yes. Does anyone know how to say yes in Spanish? Yes. Come on, guys. I thought you were smarter than that. The way you say yes in Mexican is yes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Everybody understand? Like All right. The last word no, is no. Does anyone know C. how to say no in Spanish? Oh, I got it now. It's no. El No O. What? What? What kind of Spanish is that? Cody, you are so dumb. You have a lot of Spanish to be learning. The way you say no in Spanish is right. no. No mean no in all languages. <laughs> How you be so stupid, El No? Crappy, dumb. What? Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, that's fair. I was just putting L and O at the beginning and end of every word like you were. Well, come on, Cody. This is getting really easy. Spanish is easy. Screw off, you All right, Chris. I know some of you had trouble learning your Spanish today. But what I want you to do is tonight go to a Mexican restaurant and try to test out your Spanish. See how far along you get. All right, and remember, if they say hot plate, that means out, no touch. Do not touch it or else you burn your hand. All right, I know we didn't get to food items today, but remember, burrito and taco are same thing in Mexican. And also, when in doubt, add L and O to the word, and you're probably right. Good luck, class. See you tomorrow. Ugh, what a long and exhausting day of school today, Cody. Yeah, I know. It's almost like we didn't learn anything at all. But yes, we did, Cody. We learned Spanish. No, we didn't, Junior. Nothing that he taught us was actually Spanish. Well, yes, it was, Cody. He's a teacher. He knows what he's talking about. He's an idiot. He doesn't know what he's talking about. And nothing he taught us was real Spanish. Okay, Cody, look, I understand that, you know, we only know English, so learning a new language is going to be hard for us. So I understand hearing another language is going to sound like gibberish. So, yes, Spanish right now doesn't make sense to us, but eventually we're going to speak fluent Spanish, and it's it's gonna make sense. Junior, I've already learned a little bit of Spanish. Yeah, today. No, no, I mean before today. Like, like earlier today? No, no, I, I mean even earlier than that, like yesterday. Like, no, I didn't learn Spanish yesterday. I learned Spanish like a while back. Like how long? Like, like earlier today? Like a few hours? No, no, not a few. Like, like a few years ago. But, okay, cool. Your time's all messed up. A few years ago? No, like no, no, earlier no, today. Junior, nothing we just learned today is real Spanish. I promise. Oh, okay, then let's go to the Mexican restaurant and test it out like he wants us to do, and we'll see if it works or not. Junior, we're gonna sound stupid. No, we're not. We're gonna sound like we're Spanish. Fine. Right, let's go, Cody. Oh man, this is my first time at a Mexican restaurant. This is so cool. Here we go now. Cody, we're not gonna leave yet. Our teacher said we have to test out our Spanish at a Mexican restaurant. So we're at a Mexican restaurant. Let's test out our Spanish. Junior, we don't even know real Spanish. Our teacher is an idiot, and we're just gonna sound stupid. Cody, we're not gonna sound stupid. Is that real cactus? No, Junior, that's a balloon and a sombrero, and we're gonna sound stupid because we're just adding L and O to everything. And besides, I can't even eat Mexican food. It'll tear apart my butthole. Not in a good way. Oh, el hello, seniors. I brought you some chips and salsa and queso and some cream. Welcome to Border Jumping Bee. My name is Burrito Taco Burrito, but you can call me Taco. That is not your real name. Hell yes, so it is, senor. What is your name? <laughs> Mi llamo es Cody. What? My name -o is Cody. Oh, bingo, what's his name? -o? What's your name, -o, senor? Oh, uh, uh, El Hello O. My name O Junior. Ah, bingo, what's his name? -o? You bingos want to order some food? Um, uh, I'd just like to buy a taco and an enchilada. What? Uh, oh, oh, I'm sorry. I, I'd like to El Bayo a taco and an enchilada. Oh, you're leaving so soon? See you later. No, no I'm not leaving. I'd like to El Bayo a taco and an enchilada. Ah, taco and enchilada for bingo. What about you, bingo? Oh, uh, I would also, I mean, uh, uh cool, can I borrow that? Yeah. I would like to El Bayo a taco and enchilada also. Oh! 
Okay, two enchilada, two taco, coming right up for the bingos. Junior, this is ridiculous. Cool, we're, we're, doing, we're doing pretty good with our Spanish. You're, you're killing it with your Spanish. You said you didn't know it, but you're killing it. Junior, this is stupid. This isn't even real Spanish. Cool, let's just eat some nachos. <sighs> Alright, bingo! Your food is ready! Hot plate! Ow! Ow! What's wrong, Cody? I burned my hand on the plate. Well, he said hot plate, but he goes, ow, no touch. You know that. Well, he touched it and it didn't hurt him. Bingo, senor! Hot plate! Oh, that's a good point, Cody. I'm gonna ask him. Uh, oh, yeah, L, excuse me, oh, L, what the L, uh, how O oh, did you O oh, touch the hot plate O oh, without it burning your hand O? Oh! Bingo, what's his name O? Oh? <laughs> did you get your answer, Junior? Did you? Uh, well, I think he's just really busy. Yeah, that's right, right. I can't wait to try this food, though. It looks really good. Try yours. Junior, I said I can't eat it, because if I do, I'm going to have a baby out of my butt. Well, Cody, maybe this is diet. Oh, my oh, goodness. Oh, you know what? You're, you're, yeah, you're right, Junior. It's probably diet Mexican food. Diet I hadn't thought of that. I guess I'll try it. Then. Yeah, it might be diet. It might make it, like, well, it won't make you sick. Mm, mm, these diet beans are actually really good, Junior. Oh, Cody, you should try this enchilada. It's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Uh -oh, uh oh What's wrong, Cody? Did you touch the plate again? Did you burn yourself? No, no, Junior. I gotta poop. I gotta poop really, really bad. Uh oh, or then use the bathroom, you weirdo. No, no, Junior. I never use public bathrooms. Cody never poops in public. Cody pooping in public? Never gonna happen. I never pull a CPP. You never pull a CPP? No. Well, you poop in private, right? Oh, well, yeah. So that's a CPP. Cody poops in private. Well, well, it's a CPP, but it, it's not the same kind of CPP. Look, it doesn't matter, Junior. I have to poop. We need to leave right now. So you want me to get the check? Yes, please. Where's the waiter at? Uh, Waiter, uh... Waiter! Waiter, get over here! Did you need something, Bingo? Yes, I have to poop. I, I need to check right now. Oh, we're actually running a special today. If you El Bio this book, then your meal is free. <laughs> what? I don't want to buy a book. I just want to pay for my dinner. Well, it's a good deal, Cody. If, if you buy the book, your meal is free. We basically ate for free. Well, it's not free if I'm buying the book, Junior. But the meal is free, senor. Yeah, it's, it's a good deal, Cody. Well, okay, okay, fine. I will buy your stupid book. What? Oh, I'm sorry. I will El Bio your book. Oh, you're leaving so soon? Without paying? You dine in ditch? <laughs> I will El Bio your book. Oh, okay. Oh, Better doing business with you, senor. Can we, can we go now, Junior? Uh, Cody, I say bye to him. El Bio! Dr. Seuss! <laughs> oh, what was that, Cody? Oh, Cody, you said bye while holding the book, didn't you? <laughs> Are you funny, Cody? <laughs> Junior, Junior, I, I pooped in my panties. What? I pooped panties? in my panties, Junior. I have, I have mesh panties, and I just made Play-Doh spaghetti in my pants. Uh, uh, well, Cody, look. At least we learned Spanish, and you, and you bought a book, just like the teacher taught us. So you do know Spanish, Cody. You learned Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, God, it was down. Can you hear it? Just keep moving. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. What a weird dream. Oh, man. I'm gonna call Cody. Come on, Cody, answer. Hello? Cody, I just had the weirdest dream. I had a dream that we were in school, we learned Spanish, and then we went to a Mexican restaurant, and, and you bought a book, and then you pooped your pants. That wasn't a dream, what? Junior. That was earlier today. I'm still on the toilet. Now hang up so I can finish reading Green Eggs and Ham. <laughs> I do not like to say my ham. I do not like Green Eggs and Ham. Uh, I don't really don't like Applebee's that much.